All right, guys, serious videos today. I haven't really done something like this on my channel before, but I really sort of wanted to do this. It's been on my mind for a few days. I wanted to sort of get it to you in like a one-on-one -on -one talk. So what I want to talk about this video is hate and like people's opinion of you. So we've all, we all know what hate is. We've all either been a victim of it, given it, witnessed it, been a part of it. In some way, you've been related to some sort of hate or someone's put across their opinion of you to you. Now, I'm not going to go into deeper sort of subjects like self-harm because that really isn't my place. I don't know about it. I don't want to offend anyone by talking about it. It's really not my place to be talking about that kind of stuff. So this video is going to be sort of a half story, half sort of rant sort of thing. I don't really know what to call this. So I didn't really want to title this video bullying, because bullying is a huge wide aspect. You've got like physical bullying, emotional, psychological, stuff like that. So I, don't, I didn't want to title this bullying, so this is more of a direct subject on hate and opinions. So ever since I've started YouTube, I've got a lot of mixed comments from people in my school, uh, family, stuff like that. So I've got supportive comments from people that support me, some of my friends, family, and then you got the kids at the school. So, kids at the school have some mixed feelings towards what I do. And they're probably watching this video, but I couldn't care less. So, I've got some pretty harsh comments. And I've got some supportive comments. Now, I'm a naturally sort of quiet, keep to myself kind of person. So I don't really anger anyone. People have no reason to sort of start anything with me. So, when people do it, it's just out of nothing, really. And I've noticed that in life, no matter what you do, if you do something slightly different, so if you're at school or work or whatever you do, and you're doing something that isn't mainstream, so maybe for school it's like joining a club, so like football, if you do anything different, so if you're like me and you do YouTube and you really enjoy it, or if you're like someone else who really enjoys some sort of sport but isn't mainstream, so if you enjoy gymnastics, and you'll get a lot of hate for that because people don't know how to sort of process what you do and they just think you're an idiot for doing it and don't listen to those people do what you want to do because when i make videos i love making videos i love editing i love recording i love the thrill i get when i upload and just knowing that people are about to watch my content i really enjoy making these videos and people tell me that i'm not going to get anywhere that i'm not gonna succeed that my content sucks, and I honestly don't care. You can say what you want about my channel, you can say what you want about me, and I'm not going to take it to heart, because there's no point. People's opinions of you do not matter. They're not going to affect your life. I know it's easier said than done. Sort of People's opinions, have, they're going to have no effect on your life. They're just other people's opinions of you because either they're jealous or they have their own personal problems that they can't process, so they want to take them out on you. Because they're probably, like, not loved at home. Their parents probably beat them daily. Just people just hate on you for being different. And it's stupid. So if you guys have watched my vlogs or anything like that, you probably noticed I have an unnaturally long neck, and I don't know why, but I'm not really bothered, it's, I have it, it's me, I don't care, I'm different. And I get a lot of hate for that as well, like, I, I don't, I don't even care, I take the make out of myself for it, like, I came up with the nickname Giraffe, which I'm now called by a lot of people, but I only like it when it's from people that I know and I'm friends with, when you get those random kids, just call it to you for no reason, it irritates you, and I need to take my own advice, because I'm sitting there telling you guys, don't react to people that, people's comments, because their opinions of you don't matter, but I haven't been like that recently, so if you're watching this video, you probably know exactly who you are, you go to my school, and basically, these people are giving me negative comments, and I wouldn't really consider this bullying, because I'm not going to let it get to me. I honestly don't care what they think of me anymore. And I did before because I reacted to it. And that's exactly what they want. They want you to react because they want a reaction out of you. Because they want to bring your life down because their life sucks. So, I'm going to start taking my own advice. Because, I'm not going to lie, I was going to fight these people. <laughs> well, kind of. They sort of backed away. But I'm not going to get into that. 
So I was going to fight these people that were giving me negative comments, but I'm not going to. Because I'm not going to stoop to that level, because I know one punch can change your entire life. Because you can stamp on someone's head, that's happened in my school to a few kids. You can stamp on heads, you can stab someone 20, 30 times, doesn't matter. But you can punch someone once in the wrong way, or you can trip someone up, or you can push someone in the wrong way. And that will change your entire life, depending on what could happen. So, I'm going to start taking my own advice, I hope you guys do as well. I mean, some of you might be naturally aggressive, you might have anger issues, I don't know. But, I don't. I'm, I just, I used to take stuff really personally, actually I didn't. When I was younger, up until about November last year, I never really took things personally, I never really got into a fight, I was never bullied, I was never a victim of bullying, because I always shut that down, never let it happen. But up until about November, uh, I don't know what happened. <laughs> Relationships, nah, I'm joking. They're not that bad. <laughs> Fuck you. Anyway. I hope, I hope she doesn't watch this video because that'd be really awkward. She knows about my channel. But fuck you. Anyway. I think it's just me growing up. Like, I've taken stuff a lot more personally recently. I, I need to stop. I'm going to stop it from now on. I'm not going to retaliate to anyone because people are just pathetic trying to bring me down. Honestly, it doesn't affect me. And if you are one of those kids that gives out negative comments or receives negative comments, just... Well, actually, no, more, mainly giving out negative comments, but just think. The other, the person you're giving those comments to, you don't know what ha what's happening in their life. They could be a young carer, they might have to go home every day, they might have disabled parents, they might have to look after them, they might have a really ill relative. You just don't know what's going on in their life. Just think about that before you give out negative comments and you try and bully people, because you don't know what people are going through, you don't know what they have in their life. So, just think about that before you say anything, before you open your mouth and start just giving out negative comments. But don't get me wrong guys, if someone says something about someone that isn't involved, so a family member, or something like that, then by all means, swing for them. But if it's just about you, and their opinion of you, it honestly doesn't matter, because they're just trying to bring you down. But like I said, if someone doesn't assault someone that has nothing to do with the situation, then grab the baseball bat, swing for them, do anything. I don't. I just, just do it. No, I'm not gonna put. No, I'm not gonna do it. I was about to put Charlotte Buff in the video, but I'm not gonna do it. But seriously, guys, if you get into a situation where you're being verbally abused, someone shouting abuse at you, try and to not hit them, unless they hit you. If if it turns into a physical attack from them, or if you get pushed or punched in any way, or they physically try and harm you then you can hit them because one punch in aggression can change your entire life in self-defense it's completely fine so if there's one thing that i want all of you to take away from the situation is other people's opinions of you do not matter they're not going to affect your life in any way do what you want to do so me i love doing youtube but like like i said i really enjoy making it i love the thrill and the feeling of just being productive, making a video, uploading the video, seeing the view count just go up one by one, seeing the subscriber count just rise, it makes me feel really good. So I really enjoy doing what I do. I'm not going to stop. I don't care what people tell me. I'll do what I want. I hope you guys do the same. If you've got a small channel and you get a lot of hate for it, don't listen to them. It honestly does not matter. Just carry on doing what you want to do. If you really enjoy what you're doing and people are watching you and subscribing to you, Actually, that doesn't even matter. If you really enjoy doing what you're doing, you're just uploading videos, having fun, carry on doing it. Don't stop. Don't listen to people giving hate because they're only giving hate because their life sucks or they're jealous or they just want a reaction out of you because they think they look cool in front of their friends. So just don't listen to them. There's honestly no point. I apologise for the longer than usual video today, guys. This was just a, a huge subject that I was really passionate about that I really wanted to talk to you guys about and my chair is really squeaky, so I'm just trying to stay still. I apologise for the long video, like I said. This is an important subject to me. I really want to talk to you guys about it, get it out there. Just put it on into a video and just put it online, really. Just have a one-on-one -on -one talk with you about this. Because it's really important. A lot of people have the struggle of hate and they don't know how to deal with it. 
So I really hope you guys can take something away from this video, like I said. And I think that's pretty much it. I'm going away tomorrow. Today's Thursday. I'm going around on the Friday, 5.55. So there'll be a vlog from there. No more down videos, like serious videos like this. Unless you guys want to see this, leave a like. I've actually disabled comments on my videos now. So... That's another thing, if you're a small YouTuber, you can't really deal with hate yet, just disable the comments, that's what I've done. So, if you want to see another video like this, leave a like, and subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video, and goodbye.